Hi, welcome back to my channel. You're watching Save Me Fool. Today, this is a message that I wanted to share with our Save Me Fool family members. You're enough. You're good enough. You don't need to do anything more. You don't need to try more to change this, that of you. The way you are, you are good enough. The reason why I'm telling you this is because as as I'm running this YouTube channel, I also get some messages from younger people. But recently, I got this question from one uh, young girl who asked me that her self-confidence seems to be getting lower and lower every year. And as I was reading her message, you know, I couldn't help myself but to really relate to her situation and relate to how she feels. Because every day, we all struggle between feeling incredibly happy sometimes or sometimes we are so low with our self-confidence and we don't uh, see the real self-worth. But fundamentally, in order to lead the kind of life that you want and you want to create to, 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 um, to have the fulfilling, meaningful life, and feeling joyful and happy from the bottom of your heart, we gotta know and understand the self-worth, the worthiness of you. The reason is because you have to believe and understand that you are whole in order to feel peace and happier in life. Self-worth, self-confidence, self-love, all of these need to be in harmony. And fundamentally, th these need to set the foundation of your belief. Now, once you can truly believe in this, ingrain this in your mind, then you will start to feel that your confidence will grow. You will feel stronger and more solid in whatever, in whatever you try to do. So here are a few strategies that I wanted to share with you guys in order to build, cultivate, the self-confidence, self-growth, self-love. The first thing that we need to be really alert about is the comparison trap. 비교 함정, 비교 함정이에요. 이 비교 함정이라는 것은 우리가 자각하지 못하는 새 매일매일 하고 있어요, 스스로. 내가 보고 있는 상대, 내가 보고 있는 물질, 내가 보고 있는 이 모든 세상에 대해서 나와 그것을 비교하는 것이죠. 예를 들어서 Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, we have so many different kinds of social media and you start seeing all different kinds of people from all different walks of life and you start feeling, oh, she has this, but I don't have that. Oh, she is so more she is so much more beautiful and I don't feel like I'm that beautiful. Wow, he has this and I don't have that. And we start dividing into two feelings. One is, oh, I admire this person. I want to be like that person. Or two, I feel envious. I feel jealous that I don't have that. Which emotion would you like to feel? It's more obvious that we want to feel this way rather than the latter. But a lot of us fall into this comparison trap and feel the latter. This is really dangerous and not good for you at all. We know that, but it's hard to fix. 그래서 이렇게 비교 함정에 빠졌다라는 것을 자각한 순간 바로 나는 여기에서 빠져나와야 돼. You gotta get yourself out of it. You need to immediately tell yourself that I'm gonna get out of it. And then two, what you need to start doing is that you need a little break when you feel like you start to compare yourself with others around you, you need a bit of break. Take a little distance and start observing the world in a more objective way. Not from your perspective, in a completely non-emotional way. In that way, you will start feeling that, oh, the things that I was thinking, you know, comparing myself with others and the world was meaningless. 사실 이 비교라는 함정에 빠지는 것은 
예전에 어, 어디였었나요? 한국에 이제 Get It Beauty라는 그 아, 뷰티 TV 프로그램 있잖아요. 거기서 배우 이한희 씨가 그렇게 얘기를 했었어요. 비교라는 것은 나 자신을 악의 구렁텅이로 빠뜨리는 거나 다름이 없는 행위라고요. 정말 맞는 것 같아요. 그럼에도 불구하고 uh, It's in our nature. 나 자신의 진짜 가치를 어, 이해하지 못하고 그 믿음을 갖지 못하는 사람들은 이 비교함정, comparison trap에 빠져들기 굉장히 쉽, 쉬워요. 그리고 마지막으로 이런 상황에 빠졌을 때 어, write down exactly what it is that you feel envious about that person. 왜냐하면 uh, you can start thinking about this way that um, everything in this world reflects others and um, what you see in others and when you start finding attractive and intriguing about other people you have those characters within you as well but you just don't realize it 예를 한번 들어볼까요? 인터넷 uh, 서핑 하면서 제 눈길을 끄는 것들은 어, 여러 가지 다양한 것들이 있는데요 특히 뷰티 아름다움을 갖고 있는 interior designs 뭐 그리고 가끔은 어, very attractive women who seem very powerful career women um, and for those uh, women who empower other people and also I am very much intrigued by uh, people who spread hope and strong positive energy and I start noticing that the reason why I follow these people or I, I find so much attraction in these people is because I have those characters within me as well and it's a reflection instead of falling into this comparison trap and feeling miserable that oh I don't have the things that she has you don't have to think that way because you already have those characters and personalities within you. 아마도 이렇게 느끼는 순간은 내가 자극하지 못했던 내 안에 있었던 그런 캐릭터들을 더 personalities를 더 bring out 할수 있는 기회의 순간이 된다라는 것을 그 사실을 어, 이해하고 난다면 이 비교 함정에 빠질 어, 일은 점점 점점 더 줄어들 거예요. Everything needs practice. Just like uh, athletes have to go through training every single day. When they wake up, they go to trainings and they do more trainings and they do, you know, night trainings as well. It's the same thing. We need to practice. In order to build confidence, you need to train yourself to thinking this way and building that fundamental faith, knowing your self-worth. 어, 오늘 이 영상이 특히 자신감 또는 자존감에 대해 많이 고민하고 어, 굉장히 몸부림치며 힘들어 하셨던 분들에게 꼭 도움이 되었으면 좋겠어요. 왜냐하면 이 세상엔 uh, There is no one who feels completely uh, satisfied with themselves um, 100% there are always going to be moments that you feel insecure. Even the hottest celebrities around the world, they feel this way. And sometimes they're the ones who fall into these comparison traps very often. And um, unfortunately, uh, they start to 자기 자신의 인생을 너무나도 힘들게 하는 그 함정에 더 빠지게 되는 경우도 많이 보잖아요. 뉴스를 봐도 그렇고요. 그러기 때문에 음, 말 가장 중요한 것은 knowing your self-worth and this is kind of a little practice every single day. You just need to um, 어렸을 때 걸음마를 해 나가는 것처럼 자전거를 처음 배울 때 매일매일 조금씩 조금씩 나아지는 것처럼 it needs practice and I'm gonna be with you guys. I myself also struggle with this every single day. So you are not at all alone. You are beautiful as who you are and you need to know your self-worth in order to enjoy the much blessing that the God has given to us. 어, 오늘 영상 마음에 드셨다면 꼭 give it a thumbs up and also 
press the like button and also uh, Semi for philosophy 중에 가장 중요한 게 뭐라 그랬죠? Sharing is always better than not sharing, right? Okay, um, that's it for today. I think I've said enough in this video. You are good enough, you are enough, and I celebrate your beauty in your heart. And I know how much passion and love all of our Semi family members have for life. So celebrate it. As always, thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you guys the next time on Same You Fool. Ciao! Mwah. So for an example, um, it's been about a... It will soon become... As I've been running this...